Hello and welcome to SDSC Specialist Cars. This is our video review of our 2004 BMW 730i diesel. Um, been really well looked after this car. Um, two owners from new, last owner uh, has had the car about 10 years. Uh, been really well looked after, local car as well. Um, what a lot of car for no money. That's all I can say on this car. It drives amazingly, absolutely amazing. No wonder, you know, these are the flagship cars that they put all the options on. And um, I mean, this must have been the best part of 80 grand when it was new. And, but it's the three litre diesel, so it does 30 to the gallon. You know, I drove it back the other day actually from the dealer. Average 35, 34.9. So 35 to the gallon, can't go wrong. You know, what a car. Anyway, we'll have a look at the condition, starting on the front wing here. All nice and clean on there, no marks or anything. And front wheel there, again, really clean, really nice. Coming down the driver's side, all really lovely, no dents or marks or scratches or anything, so really, really nice. And the rear wheel there, again, spot on. Round the back of the car. Again, all really lovely on here. We haven't got any scratches or marks on here either. Electric opening boot too. Like I say, and it's a good looking car too. I like the quirkiness of it. And the rear wheel there. Coming along the passenger side. Lovely shine in the paint as you can see. Look at that. Look at the bonnet there, look at the shine on that, it's fantastic. 2004. Front wheel there again, absolutely spotless. Around the front of the car. Headlights are nice and clear. Bonnet's lovely, there's no stone chips or anything on the car. It's not had a hard life, it's not a motorway car. And the mileage depicts that. We'll come around and have a look inside. We've got, oh God, we've got everything. I don't even know where to start. Um, we'll start with the seat. So driver's seat, nowhere on here at all. Absolutely lovely, look at that. And we've got automatic headlights over here. You can see that on there. We've got radio controls on the steering wheel. We've got flappy paddles at the top, which on the, on the steering wheel here, I like that. Um, the only fault we've got found with the car at the moment, the FM radio is not working. Don't know why, but we'll have a look at that. Um, we've got the iDrive as well. This was the first car with the iDrive. And look at this, look. I like this, look. Press this little button here. Mobile phone, look at that. And then you press that, and that pops the phone. But of course, if you don't want to use that phone, you just want to use the keypad, you can just use the dialing keypad on the side. Look. Climate control in here as well, for dual, dual climate control of course, for passenger and driver. And we've got dual trip computers. Right, so I'll just press that. I'll just start to run. Oh, PDC failure. I'm right, we'll do that in a minute. Service in 30,000 miles. PDC is parking uh, sensors. And we'll just go through the trip here. 27.5 because it's been started and stopped. And you see on there she's done 88,749 miles. But well, listen, you can't hear it, it's lovely. Cruise control down here as well. Average speed, there you go, that's why it's um, 27. Average speed, 20, 20 miles per hour. You get dual um, controls on here. 43 miles till we run out of fuel. Just very clever. Start and stop button on here as well. Memory seats. I love the fact that you select which part of the seat you want to move and then you move the dial to adjust it. Driver's door card, electric mirrors, the handbooks and everything on there, and the DVD for the sat nav. We'll open the bonnet while we're here. And look in the door shuts and everything, she's just lovely. Anyway. Such a lot of car. Back seats don't really look like they've been sat in. Really clean. Scratches on there. Oh no, it's, oh, it's like a crayon. 
Yeah, that one's coming off. We'll wipe that off. Round the back of the car. Press the button. Now that's magic. Look at the boot. Oh, it doesn't look like it's ever had anything in it. Oh, even the toolkit's all there. I did check it the other day. There we go. Look, there's the toolkit. The wrench, the triangle, and everything all still in the right places. Round to the passenger side. Look at that. And even the wood on the dashboard, it's just lovely. It's a satin sheen on it. I'm sorry I get so excited about these cars. It's, it's in the details on, the, on these big executive cars. Look at the little piston to close the door, you know. All other cars just have a little plastic lever. Then we come around and have a look under the bonnet. This is the best bit. It's under here. It is like brand spanking new. Look at that. All the little nuts and bolts are absolutely perfect. Look, all the hoses, everything is, there's no corrosion anywhere. It's never been sat outside in its life. Look. Like I say, it's just so much car for no money. And the, the mechanicals are all old school BMWs. They're all cheap. It's just a winner. Anyway, there we have it. That's our video review of our 2004 BMW 730 diesel. What a car. Should you have any more questions, please give me a call. My name is Stuart and our website is www.sdsc.co.uk. Many thanks for watching.